Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand, this is for Commit K 2024 and I'm going to talk about the computer based test CBT guidelines which you need to follow. And this is taken from the Commit K information brochure and uh, so this is the guideline overall. First is that you know CBT requires candidate to sit in front of computer terminal node uh, allocated to them and against the TAT number and the admit card. So hope all if you have downloaded the admit card and there is some issue in the refreshing of the admit card. So you please keep trying and you will be able to final, finally download the admit card. So once you log in into the computer which is provided in the center, the candidate will get the detailed instructions for the examination, right? And also the Comet K provider has provided the seven to eight mock test. If you want to practice that at your home, you can do that. So at the designated time of start of examination, right? Candidate will be able to proceed and see the questions on the com computer screen using the computer mouse, right? So system or the mouse have been selected after thoroughly auditing and checking the good performance. So that is assured. But, but in case the computer or mouse allotted to you or any candidate is not working very good or it is having some malfunctions, right? So during the test, so there is enough buffer systems or computer nodes are provided in your center. So if you tell to your in, 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 invigilator, basically he, she will immediately allot a new system from the buffer system to you. So that is very important. So, uh, so, and it is assured that there is enough buffer systems in every centers to take care of such problems. And whatever time is lost due to change of system that will be taken care of. You don't need to worry. If there is some time loss because you are moving from one system to other, everything will be taken care and your time will be recorded on the server and it will be adjusted in such a way that you will always get a full three hours, right? That one hour per paper. So but basically Comet K authority is saying that it is sole responsibility of the candidate to bring this type of malfunctioning of computer or mouse system to the invigilator and they will assure that they will automatically transfer to you to the new terminal and whatever time is lost that will be adjusted. So you don't need to worry at all but raise the issue with invigilator. Second is the countdown timer will display the remaining time available to complete the examination. So that will be on the top right side of the screen, right? And a question palette, that question area will be called question palette. So question palette would displayed on the right side of the screen will show the status of each question. You can easily navigate to any questions by clicking on the question number. So you can directly move from question number 42 to question number uh, 55 and so on, right? And you can mark a question for review and then come back for saving the correct option. That option is also possible, right? But if you have marked it for review, it will be taken as your answer, right? And uh, later, um, if you want to change it, you can change it. Otherwise, it, it, it is assumed as submitted. You can view the answering status of the section by placing the mouse over the name of the section. So that also you can do. There are three sections, you know, physics, chemistry and maths. And you can view all the questions by clicking on the question paper button also. You can shuffle between the different sections, right? And change the options, optional sections any number of times in case of all subjects. So that complete Flexibility is provided to move. It is similar to what you saw in the J mains exam or VT exam or any other, right? It is similar system which has been designed by Comet K authority also in the computer based test CBT. And, and also important thing, marking system already most of you know, right? Correct answer is awarded one marks and there will be no negative marking, right? And merit rank card is generated based on the candidate score in entrance test only. The, this rank card is basis for the participation on the select selection process. So that's all overall guideline with respect to the you know computer based system. Thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar other